Lord, thank you so much for this day. Thank you for this evening as the darkness falls. I look to you and I say, Father, thank you for bringing me through this day. Thank you for keeping me and putting me on the right path, helping me to walk ever more closer to Jesus. Lord, I have a long way to go, but I thank you for where you've brought me from. Now, Father, I pray for people who have lost loved ones and who are in deep pain, heartache, challenges of loneliness, of loss. Lord, comfort them. Bless them with your presence and your peace. May they hear Jesus saying, he who believes in me, even though he die, yet shall he live. And whoever lives and believes in me shall never die. And then he said, do you believe? Lord, we believe and we want those who are in these difficult positions that are in Christ to embrace these great promises. And if they're not in Christ, Lord, we pray that today would be the day of salvation by the grace of God alone, through faith alone, in Jesus Christ alone. Lord, we also pray for those who are caught up in the war in the Ukraine. We pray for them to be delivered from that. We pray for the people that attack them to go back where they came from and then make proper response to all of the great damage and destruction they've done by making it right. Lord, help us, help me, help all of us to stand up for what's right, stand behind things that are right and true. And Lord, to stand opposed to those things that are not right and true, according to your own word. Lord, to love people as we love ourselves but to stand on the truth and not turn aside to the right or the left. Help us, Lord. We need your help in these and in all things. We pray through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen.